So methamphetamine is uh, also a special danger because in very purified form, when people take you know quite a bit of it, um, it can result in actual physical damage to dopamine synapses and dopamine cells. Uh, it can be what we call neurotoxic. It has you know significant toxic impacts on the brain. Um, and uh, you know the purity of the meth actually has risen and fallen depending on the sources of you know supply for the raw materials for methamphetamine. And there's a video up here that will uh, explore this um, in greater depth. Um, but what you know, methamphetamine is a very potent psychostimulant, right? And one of the um, the the sort of features of these psychostimulants, or you know, in, in other in, also known they're, they're called sympathomimetics because they they sort of uh, mimic or activate the sympathetic division of the autonomic nervous system, which results in you know significant um, like um, constriction, vascular constriction, and particularly in the periphery, uh, in the face, in the hands, etc. And um, what that does is it starves tissues you know, for uh, nutrients. Um, and it will uh, make it less likely that you're going to be able to, uh, you know, heal injury. Uh, there's another kind of um, aspect to high methamphetamine exposure, um, both animal and animal studies when they're given high doses of meth and also people when they, you know, consume high doses of meth, they start to engage in these behaviors called stereotypies where they, you know, will pick and scratch at themselves. Um, and when they do that, they can damage skin, for example, on the face. And then those sores that formed aren't getting properly vascularized. They're not getting properly, you know, uh, having proper blood de delivery. And so they're going to end up um, never really properly healing. Uh, and this has been particularly noted like in the mouth, in the gums, you know, where people will, you know, uh, if they're taking lots of meth, um, you know, first of all, their diet is not particularly good. So they'll guzzle, you know, two liter bottles of soda and things like that. But the, the, the gums are not particularly vascularized. The mouth will dry out with that sympathetic activation. Um, and, you know, the gums can get very infected, inflamed. Uh, the teeth you know, can start to fall out. There's something as a, a horrible thing that was noted by a um, dentist called meth mouth. And I've got some links up there that you can uh, explore this a little bit further too.